Hey y'all, Oracle Scarlet Dragon Star here with the Viking Oracle Wisdom of the Ancient Norse. We have that came out, I'm not sure if I'm saying it right, Scotty, Sc Scotty, it probably says how to say it, Scotty, or Skada, Skadi. From Scandinavia. Okay, so it's 34. Know yourself. It is important. It is the most important of life's work. Express your independence. Let authenticity be your guide. Compromise is part of every relationship, but when you comp. But when compromise pushes you to be someone else you're not, a change should be made. There is an easier way to do things. Speak plainly. So it says, The horizon brings me joy. There is so much to discover, unfettered by what is not mine. I speak my truth, and I am heard and heeded. I sing along with my wolves in harmony. I am myself. I am Scotty. Scott. God die. Shakti. I don't know. Shak Shakti. So she's a Norse goddess, best known in the mount mountainous parts of the region. Beautiful, strong, resourceful, and independent. Her name is linked to the words for unknown and darkness. Um, and maybe even the source of the word Scandinavia, a land dedicated to her. She is a huntress and an archer, a keeper of wolves, and most of all, a lover of snow and of the highest of mountains. So, it says when this card steps into your life, when Shakti steps into your life, she is reminding you that being honest, direct, and respecting your own personal freedom is paramount. If you need to if you need to courage to be who you really are ask Shakti for assistance I'm wondering if that is what it is then we have 16 so so Ulo. I'm not sure if I'm saying that right uh, forgive me if I'm butchering their names um Let's see, hers is pronounced so e e o lo so e o lo so e o lo You are on purpose. You are on purpose. You are on the right path. You may need to leave others behind to reach your goal. Truth is right in front of you, should you choose to see it. You may have experienced dark times, but your future is bright. So it says, I turn my face towards the sun, and the path stretches out in front of me. I know I have learnt the truth. It is a solitary thing, but brightly it shines. Right action it is. I am so Leo. Huh. And it's the rune of the sun, Solo. As the sun illuminates all, concerns itself with revealing the truth. Truth regarding personal purpose and intent, truth within oneself, and truth in the decimation of information and in speech. So in the absence of writing contracts, the Vikings' word was their truth and their bond. Truth is one of the nine virtues mentioned in the Eddas, where people... Where people are warned about setting and breaking where they're warned about setting and breaking false troths or troths to the ancient Norse the word had real currency and worth being truthful or not could be the difference between surviving or not this rune asks us to consider whether or not we are being true to ourselves whether or not we are following our true path are we living according to the standards of others rather than our own? Does our work take full advantage of our inherent gifts? 
or are we hiding our light underneath the basket? Have we put on a mask to hide our true, truest self, lest it be seen or damaged further? How closely are we living in accordance with who we are? Fire element. Wow, it's badass. All right, and we have facing us 18 Burkano. Not sure if I'm saying that correctly. Uh, Burkano. Carno. Burkano. All right. It says, from something small and insignificant, something big will grow. A birth, literal or figuratively, will change your life. Take the current opportunity for a fresh start. Keep your plans close to your chest. S silence is wisdom's best reply. Silence is wisdom's best reply. A tiny seed, fruit of my own, set down... Sets down upon the softness, its roots small but determined. No one sees, no one hears, and all grows stronger. Ready soon, but not yet. My will made physical. I am Burkano. So Burkano is the ruin of the birch, a straight, beautiful white bark tree with eye-like markings on its trunk. So, birches are the Norse's, Norse's tree of new beginnings, and Birkenau has at its energetic heart two concepts, birth and secrecy. Hmm. So, it says Birkenau was also used to mark vows of silence or of secrecy, and those that broke such oaths were punished. Today, with gossip, gossip extending, into bullying and other negative business, the balancing energies of Birkenau are needed more than ever. When we are birthing something new, whether it be a new business, a creative project, or a new relationship, it is wise to keep our plans and dreams quiet and protected. Why? Because our plans are the most vulnerable at the early stages of growth. Just like a photos in the womb, the early days are the most risky. Therefore, it is wise to keep that which is new and precious close to our chest while it gains power and momentum. Many a uh, project or dream is crushed in its early stages by someone's careless critique or negative comment. True, that is correct. Alright, so that's what we're facing. Um, we have Shakti and Solo, Solo, alright, I hope you got some insight and some clarity, and you join me again next time, bye.